yellow there. Okay. <laughs> I guess this is, I don't know what part of the vlog this will be, but long story short, basically my mom and dad, my parents, um, are going away again, so I have to babysit. You're probably thinking, Michael, they just went to New- I know. I know. So I'm gonna go get gro- I'm gonna go grocery shopping because we need food. That we need food, y'all. All right, y'all, so we had lunch, and then afterwards, after I put up the groceries, I was just, like, tired, and I went to sleep. I was like, it was one of those naps where you didn't plan it, and I was knocked. Um, so I'm going to read my book. I'm currently reading um, Tender is the Flesh by um, Augustina Barda Bastarica. Um, who's, I don't know, I'm so sorry. I don't know who the translator is. See, that's the downside of it, is that they don't, show you who the translator is um that shit important man come on now i gotta give the translator a, a break uh, it is translated from the spanish by sarah masters so yeah um this battery is about to die it's flashing but the one thing i did want to do is taste this coffee it's Kawa hawaii kona iced coffee i got it from the korean store when i went after um grocery shopping hurry the camera's about to die Mm, this has milk in it. Crap. It's pretty good though. Hello there. Oh, let me put y'all right there. I swear y'all, this angle, um, I gotta fix it or something. It is Saturday and you know what? I don't have to babysit today because my sister was like, I'll babysit for you. And I was like, thank you. Um, so I am going to go to Atlanta. Hey, and it's going to be one of those things where I got to I'm literally going just to eat now i'm debating whether or not i should go to this restaurant and make reservations uh for like a tasting menu and i think it would be fun obviously the thing though is like tasting menus aren't for everybody so i'm just gonna go by myself because you know some people love to choose their food no choose my food for me and i'm obviously gonna go to a coffee shop now <sighs> basically i'm going to go to the places where the other day when i went um to atlanta long story short um they they were closed so i didn't end up going and i was like oh, damn i want to go but i think i'm gonna go now since it's saturday the downside is am i gonna regret the traffic most likely yes but <sighs> all right i'm here thank god first off i'm going to a korean like hot pot stone pot place um first off it is a it's great that it's free parking because, y'all, there have been some places, <laughs> I was like, why I gotta pay for parking? Ah! So, yeah, I'm gonna go. There's also a K-pop store next to it, so... I might look around. Oh, yeah. There was a, uh, a K-pop store next to the restaurant, and, you know, I browse up in there. I'm not gonna lie, it was like, overwhelming. There was so much stuff. But I did end up just buying a um, a pen, a shiny pen. I'm just gonna put it in my backpack. Okay, so that place, um, Oh my god, it was so nice. Like, that's one of the nicest coffee shops I've ever been to. It was incredible, actually. Um, I just got in, like, one of their uh, lavender drinks. Um, it's really good, actually. The coffee's great. But it's also, like, a plant place. So they sell plants. And it's just aesthetically beautiful. Like, wow, 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 wow. So I made re dinner reservations I'm not sure how far it is, so I just wanted to be, make sure. Yeah, I'm about to go. Oh, man, that place was great. Um, I did read some of my book, which was awesome. Uh, yeah, that place was uh, so nice. It's so, it's so nice. Okay, y'all, so I've fallen to temptation. So I have just a little bit of time. Um, just a little bit, just like a little bit. And um, the restaurant's not that far away. So I'm gonna go to this bookstore. <laughs> it's called Acapella Books. They sell used and new books. Um, it's one of my favorite um 
bookstores here in um, Atlanta. I just, I just really like it. So yeah, I'm gonna go look in there now. I will not, I will try to buy not a lot, but we'll see how that goes. All right, y'all. What does my hair do? I gotta fix my hair before I go. <laughs> Anyways, um, so let me tell you what I got. I got two books. Uh, it was under twenty dollars, which was great because um, it, it it they have a they have a used section, so um, that's really good. The first one that I got is Severance by Ling Ma. This now I've been wanting to read this for quite a while because of the pink that I remember like when it came out. I was like, ooh, look at the pink. It's very eye catchy i don't know what it's about i think it has zom zombies in it um because it doesn't really have a blurb so we'll see how that goes um i'm gonna read these books for sure okay y'all for real the other one i got is girl woman other by Ber bernardine evaristo i've heard this is the man booker prize last year was or two years ago um i'm really excited to read it i'm glad i bought this in this form because i technically could have read this digitally but it has um breaks in it so it looks like almost like poetry so i'm excited this tasting menu is gonna be a lit The whole thing actually was delicious. It was fantastic. I had a great time. Um, I think the least successful dish was the duck. Um, I don't know. The duck didn't taste. I had like better duck, just like at the regular, regular schmegler Chinese like restaurant. I don't know. It, it, something about it. I just wasn't. It's was like mm. overall though, everything else was delicious. The one thing I had really high expectation for was that dessert because, in case you don't know, I live in Georgia. So anytime you put peach anything. It has to be good. Like there is no, there is no excuses. Like we are the peach state. Like there is no excuse. And it was delicious. Hey, Hold on, Glee. <laughs> What's my hair doing? Morning. Um, it's the day after Atlanta. <sighs> Y'all, I had a great time. <laughs> I had a good time just eating. I love it. So yeah, ever since I got my new car, um, I just been putting like some money aside every week and whatnot, just so I can go up there, like including gas and whatnot, because it really does, it has good mileage. So I just save some money aside like every week and whatnot, and then just use that money to go up there and just basically eat. So that's what I did. I, uh, I will do it more often than anything. Um, but I think, next, I think with a caveat I'm gonna make myself do is that I will buy books there, obviously, Duh, this is a booktube channel. But for me to go back up there, ooh, big brain, big brain. Uh, for me to go back up there and like go have another um, food eating adventure, I need to finish the books that I actually buy there. See, look, look, big brain over here, big brain. Avocado toast. And I'm gonna use the last of these beans that I got um, cause it's about to be gone. Hello there. Um, so it is the afternoon now, and all I'm basically doing is my laundry. That's about it. Um, just a lazy Sunday today. Nothing really going on. So I'm going to make some coffee in a few, and go outside and just read. Um, that's it. That's it. I played some video games earlier, so...
Got to plug it in. The thing about this though is, um, so I use this fellow, um, the fellow kettle um, to boil water. And the funniest part is I don't, I should be making coffee at home more often instead of going to the coffee shop because this actually don't take that long. The longest part that takes is actually um, boiling the water. Pardon my reach. I use my phone to do the countdown. I do four minutes. Well, why am I so yellow? Come on, white balance. Okay, so I am gonna make iced coffee. Here we go. Um, I noticed when I was filming, I was like, oh, this is pulling too fast. I was like, oh. Still smells good. So yeah, just gonna pour it up in here. This actually tastes delicious cold. Um, I really like it. But we gonna be outside. Woohoo! That kick! I went to Piggly Wiggly just to go get some stuff before, um, since I was babysitting. Now, I was so surprised to find this. This is a Starbucks caramel macchiato creamer. First off, to find it at Piggly Wiggly, shocking, okay, shock. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try the creamer first and if I don't feel like it's, we'll, we'll see how it tastes. Cause I'm feeling kind of basic today. Um, otherwise, I would just drink it like this. Uh, but I also got me some almond milk. Oh my it smells good. It smells like, actually low key, it smells like caramel macchiato. Okay, I'm gonna see how it tastes. I don't like that much creamer. Ooh, ooh, she thick. She thick, y'all. Let's see how it tastes. Mmm. It's the perfect balance. I personally like more of the coffee than the sweetener, but this is delicious. It's like right there. Mm. All right, y'all. I'm in the front yard. No, hold up. Wait a minute. <laughs> so we have this little uh, picnic table thingy, my bob, right over here. Um, it's a really nice day. There goes my aunt. Um, okay, she's making yeah. breakfast. Uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna sit out here. I got the book ready. Um, I'm almost done with this. Don't don't believe the chapter three. This is chapter this is chapter three of part two. So I'm almost done. But after that, I am going to. Um, actually get a good start on um, on this uh, because I, I was like on page 25 or so. Enter all. Bruh. I got my coffee right here. Hold up. We gonna chill and vibe. Hard more vibing, me chilling. Um, I also bought this little, uh, I think it's like a matcha thingy. I don't know what it is. From Tree Story, it's like a Korean brand pastry thingy. So yeah, I've got that some snacks i got my little pot yo these pocket things are it's what you guys should buy so they come in like a pack these are like meant for to go onto in like your um your lunch box these are really great because they're just like small and there's like enough in here for me anyways um like to keep me satisfied like the sweet craving that i have uh like when i'm at um when in, for lunch uh, and they're just so small I just put them in my lunch box and they're just they're great and they're cheaper they're actually you get if you buy the lunch pack pocket in my opinion I feel like it's cheaper because you get more yeah y'all ever ate pockets and was like when you were a kid and you just like pretend like you were smoking them like 